Taipei is full of architectural gems and places of beauty, but some are hidden away or known only by history buffs. To help promote Taipei scenic spots, the Taipei City government has selected the city's top seven this year from a total of 58. The National Palace Museum and Taipei Children's Amusement Park won the award for exceptional accomplishment, while Taipei 101 Observatory, Beitou Museum and Qingtian 76 were uh, given the award for excellence. Formosa News reporter takes us to Qingtian 76, a Japanese-style residence built in 1931, to learn about the history and preservation of the building. We're currently at Qingtian 76, a Japanese-style residence built in 1931. Qingtian 76 was recently awarded as one of the top scenic spots in Taipei. The tour guide gives a tour of the house. He explains the ways in which the building infuses both Japanese and Western architectural styles. For example, the windows are a combination of Japanese and Western style. It has a bay window and a Japanese window with Western wood shutters. This house is called Qingtian 76 and was built by Masashi Adachi in 1931. Adachi was an agricultural science professor. In 1945, the house became the residence of Professor Ma Tingying, who was the chairman of the National Taiwan University's Geoscience Department. However, as time passed, the old houses were abandoned. It wasn't until 2011 that the Golden Seas Education Organization started to restore Qing Tian 76. At that time, the first thing I wanted to do was introduce the research carried out by my teacher's teacher, Professor Ma Tingying. Also, I found that the old house was not maintained, so I wanted to take care of it. Every day we perform garden maintenance. We have a maintenance record sheet, including an indoor daily maintenance sheet. We have also invited architects to propose different methods of rehabilitation. The Cultural Bureau has to review the proposal before they can carry out the work. The building was named a historic monument by the Taipei Municipal Government in 2016. Visitors can sign up for free cultural tours. For example, there is a geoscience tour that allows visitors to learn more about different kinds of rock specimens on Taiwan proper, as well as offshore. In addition to introducing the formation of three types of rocks, we will also discuss the reasons for the formation of our island of Taiwan. For the historical part, we will introduce the architectural changes to the house, the mixture of Japanese and Western style. We also talk about Professor Adachi and Professor Ma. The house was converted into a restaurant in 2011, serving Japanese cuisine. How do they promote a balance between a restaurant and a historic monument? The first way to achieve the balance is not allowing too many people to visit. The second way is that if we run a restaurant, people may be unaware of how the past owner used the house. So we always emphasize that our free guided tours in the morning provide the history about the previous owner and the kind of research he carried out. Qing Tian 76 is 90 years old this year. The Golden Seas Education Organization hopes to continue preserving the beautiful residence and keep its story as well as Taiwan's history alive. For Mosa News, Stephanie Yang, Zhang Weiyao in Taipei.